Airframe Cabin Atmosphere Control Systems What are the two groups of independent cabin compressors? Positive displacement and centrifugal. What is the principal control of a pressurization system? An outflow valve. What method is used by some turbine powered aircraft for pressurization? Bleed air from the turbine engine compressor. What is a roots blower? An engine driven compressor. What pressurization control unit will charge the position of an outflow valve? The cabin pressure controller. What is the function of ventilating air in a combustion heater? It is the air that is warmed and sent into the cabin. What are sources of ventilating air in a combustion heater? A blower, fan, or ram air. What components are used in an air cycle cooling system? An expansion turbine, air to air heat exchanger, and various valves. What causes a temperature drop in air cycle cooling system. A compressed air performs the work of turning a turbine and it undergoes a pressure and temperature drop. How does a water separator remove moisture from the air? The moist air passes through veins that swirl the air and the droplets are collected and drained. What is water cycle cooling? A closed system in which a refrigerant is circulated through tu tubing and a variety of components to remove heat from the aircraft. What components are in vapor in a vapor cycle cooling system? A receiver, dryer, evaporator, compressor, condenser, and expansion valve. How does a continuous flow oxygen system operate? Oxygen flows from a charged cylinder through a high pressure line to a reducing valve and to mask outlets. How does a basic pressure demand oxygen system operate? Oxygen flows from a charged cylinder to a pressure demand regulator adjustable by each crew member. What must be accomplished if an oxygen system has been open to atmosphere for two hours more? The system must be purged to remove moisture. What is used to purge oxygen lines of moisture? Dry nitrogen, dry air, or oxygen. 
What type of oxygen must be used in aircraft? Aviators breathing oxygen. Why is oil added to a vapor cycle freon system? To seal and lubricate the compressor. What safety precautions should be observed when servicing oxygen systems? Clean, grease-free tools, clothing, hands, no smoking or open or open flames within 50 feet. Do not use adhesive tape of any kind.